The Forest Detective, case number six. A clear brook. The brook goes boo boo boo. The fish go wiggle wiggle. I thought only fish moved in the water. Oh, it moved. Moved. How did the rock move? The brook goes bubble bubble. The rocks go wiggle wiggle. Rocks can't move on their own. Something's going on. Okay, okay up, up to, to the sea. sea. Move, move out. out. We don't have time to go fishing, you guys. Come on, we'll kill two birds with one stone. Catch some fish and do some detective work. Why, you? <coughs> Fine, you, you win. win. We, we won't, won't go, go fishing. fishing. Huh? Move out! Now let's start investing. Uh, uh, where did Baba and Molly go? Oh. Hmm? I see they dived straight into the water to investigate. So proud. That's my team for ya. <laughs> They move around quite a bit, so I'm sure they're hard to find. All right, I'll go look for them this time. The coast is clear. Who says you need a fishing rod to catch fish? Let's cook them over a fire! I was keeping an eye out for even the slightest movement. playing tricks on me, it definitely didn't have any legs. But the rock moved on its own. I found it! Oh no, we're caught. We haven't solved our case yet. And you're here leisurely cooking up some fish, huh? Uh, you got it wrong. We were looking for the rocks, too. Uh, where are you moving rocks? Come out, come out, wherever you are. They're not here. Uh, They're in the water down here. It's, it's moving. moving. What? Another moving rock? The leaf is moving. It's probably just a tadpole carrying a leaf. No, it's not. There isn't a tadpole in sight. This is crazy. Now a leaf is moving on its own? Hold on. So rocks are moving on their own? And leaves are moving on their own too? If this keeps up, up, will big boulders start moving on their own? What if trees start moving? What if mountains move? After waiting and watching for hours, we observed that the mountains stayed in place. The trees stayed put too. They didn't move at all. Oh, it's moving! The boulder is moving! Oh, oh, oh. That's because you're shaking your head, Baba! <laughs> oh, is that why? The only things moving around were animals and insects. In that case, how can we explain the moving rocks and leaves? Maybe it's not a rock, but a fish that just 
Looks like a rug. So then, there's an insect that looks like a leaf? Oh, that could be it. You guys are top-notch detectives. Hmm. A, a reward, reward for, for our excellence. excellence. Uh, 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 we need to investigate further to confirm our theory. Uh, it's definitely something that's living and breathing. To prove the rock was really just a fish that looked like one. I compared it with a real fish. But it didn't have any gills. Or even fins. It was definitely not a fish. Something was coming out of the rock. There's something inside the leaf, too! What is it? It, it came, came out! out. Uh. Oh. So the leaf wasn't moving on its own after all! And the rock wasn't moving on its own either! That's right! What was moving the rock and the leaf was... <laughs> yup! It was me, a caterpillar larva! The rock and the leaf were the homes that I made! The caterpillar larva was a house-building pro. It spun silk from its mouth and stuck small pieces of rock or sand to it to make a house. I'm making a leaf house next. Yeah, stick on some leaves. Heave-ho, heave larvae live underwater. They build houses in order to hide so they don't get eaten by hungry fish. Now, finally, case number six is solved! Uh. Uh. Oh my! There's no way! A box can move on its own! Gotcha! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he caught us again! You greedy piglets! Well, well we, only we only have two left! left. Hey! hey. <laughs> Give me one! <laughs> the mystery is solved!